Second half of the show, we start with the Red Square, Kawasaki ZX-10R Masters. And the championship is basically done and dusted. Graham Van has got it in the bag, but it's now to see who can take the final blood of the season. Class C is where all the action is going to be. Johan Leroux and Stewie Russell battling out for overall championship honours, so watch out for that. There's our championship man, Graham from Edar. He's joined on the front row there. Oh, someone's got some problems there, pulling off the track. That looks like Graham from Edar's teammate. That's Mike McSkimming. So unfortunately not heading off with the rest of the field. It's going into turn one. It is Carl Robinson, who really has had a turn of pace second half of the season and is now the man to beat. Yeah, he certainly is. He's going really well on the ZX-10. It took him a while to get used to it. Coming out of a Super M championship, but decided to step across to the ZX-10R Masters and now looks to uh, maybe take 2016's title. Took him about a season to get to grips with uh, how things are different from Super M to ZX-10. I am so impressed with Class C rider Johan Leroux. He's right up there. He's been up there this whole season and already he's up into third place on track. So great ride there as we see all the Kawasaki ZX-10s filter through. That's our Bridgestone man. That's Ian Harwood from TRP. And he also really has impressed us here, improving his times every time we go out. But that's Carl Robinson really looking good at the top of the hill here now. He's got a little bit of a gap ahead of Graham from Bedard as we go on board with my hero at the moment. That's Johan Leroux. Yeah, Leroux doing a super job. Remember, all these guys in Class C over the 55-year age. So, uh, really, these old guys can still put in some incredible lap times. And that's what it's all about here. And to be up in the top five in ZX-10s, you've got to know what you're doing. Yeah, it's not an easy thing, as we saw. The yellow bike, that's Peter DeFoss. He's been crowned our Class B champion. Oh, no, Ian Harwood, bike number 24, is coming into the pit. So, obviously, some kind of technical problem there as bike 48. That's Aubrey Marais on the first tech electrical. ZX-10 goes through in a great battle there for a top 10 position. Apana Ganapathy on board ya, flat out in the right hander onto the back straight. Oh, nice shot. Right behind him is Raymond Keel on the back number 33. Will you do him on the brakes? Raymond trying it at the last minute. Is he going to make it stick? Oh, that's an impressive move. Yeah, Keely had a big look and he's got through. Ha oh, ha, well done there, Ray. Getting through on Apana Ganapathy. So a super, super effort there and late breaking. But further back there, JB Skuma not having a great outing. Normally runs a bit higher up than that. So, uh, oh, and speaking of that, that's out. That's a big crash and it could be our leader, it is. It's Carl. Carl Robinson's gone down in turn two. Oh, obviously on the brakes a little bit too hard and just loses the front. As we look at Yaku Kose, he's heading into turn two now. Uh, on board with him, you're gonna flick it right into second gear. You can see a little bit of cement dust there going around that. Oh, nice and hard on the gas there is Yaku Kose. It's Carl Robinson somehow manages our great work from the marshals there as well to get him back on track. And that's our PE man, that's Jason Joshua. What a season he has had as well. Look at this, that's Stewie Russell making the pass on Peter DeForce up into third place. So he's really gunning for this championship. He's got Johan Leroux just ahead of him and that is his championship rival. Oh, all kinds of moves now at the top of the hill being put by riders. Yeah, it's just incredible to see the action right through the field. Oh, Tony Clem getting it all wrong. That's a massive one down into an XCon. Just ran wide ever so slightly onto the dirty stuff and just couldn't catch it. Look at that. A big slip and slide coming out there. That Bridgestone just cried out no more. And there was just nowhere to go for Tony. That's a big crash. One of the biggest we've seen all season. He made the right decision in putting that bike down because he got it wrong and the wall was coming. So great bit of riding there from Tony Clem. As we go up on the top of the hill for the final time, this on board with Peter DeForce. Stewie Russell is up into third place and Johan Leroux in second. Nothing taken away from this man, though. Graham from Ida, a faultless race and a faultless championship as he heads the line. But Johan Leroux will pick up overall honours in the C class and second overall uh, just ahead of Stewie Russell. And Peter DeForce is your overall B winner with Raymond Keel in second. Another great season of Red Square Kawasaki ZX-10R Masters Cup comes to a close with the Dog Doctor getting a little champagne shower. Well done, Graham.